Hello, my most amazing artists. So to start, you want to have a piece of paper like this. And I'm going to be drawing with a black Sharpie, but you can use a pen or black crayon, colored pencil, whatever you have. So Kandinsky would often listen to music when creating his paintings. So go ahead and grab something to draw with and get your favorite song playing, and then we will get started on our drawing. So I'm going to start by drawing a big shape that is nice and curved in the middle of my paper. And this is an organic shape because it is free flowing. So you want to listen to your music and draw whatever shapes come to mind. So maybe the song you're listening to has a strong and really sharp beat to it. So maybe you want to draw a big and sharp shape like a triangle. So I'm going to draw a triangle that overlaps with that first shape that I drew, like so. So I'm going to keep adding shapes all over my paper while listening to my music. So you can even have some shapes that come off the page a little bit, like that. And you want to make sure you use lots of overlapping. So I'm just going to continue to fill up my whole paper. So now it is time to add color. So rather than making a whole shape just one color, where they overlap, I'm going to add different colors. So for example, I will make this side of this square shape one color, and then this side will be another color. Like this will be one color, that part will be another color, and so on. Grab whatever markers, crayons, or colored pencils that you have to color with, and let's add lots of bright colors to our paper.
once you finish adding color, you now have your very own Kandinsky-inspired artwork. I hope that you all had fun, and remember to be creative. I cannot wait to see your incredible Kandinsky-inspired creations. Bye, everyone.